Hey guys, so I'm actually um, getting ready to leave to go to the thrift store. They have a bag sale today, um, and I don't know if I've talked about it before, but really it's like a, a trash uh, Walmart size bag for like $3 and sometimes a big bag for like $6, um, but there are restrictions on certain kind of items you can get, like only so many like pants or skirts or whatever um I know with little kid sizes there's not as many restrictions um so I might actually get some little baby clothes for uh one of my friends and my cousin um but anyway so I'm gonna go do that I did go there the other day when they had their boot sale same place and um I did get some boots and I actually did get some clothes there because I didn't want to wait until bag sale because I found a soft surrounding skirts, which I know do really well. So I wanted to go ahead and pick that up then instead of waiting till bag sale. So anyway, I'm going to go there. I'm also looking for some shorts for Marin. He wants some like darker um, shorts to wear to work because he does get like grease and oil and stuff on them. So, um, so shorts that it wouldn't show up as much. But yeah, I just um, going to head over there and it doesn't take me too long to get there. So. We're going to go do that now because it's just after 10 and they open at 10. So, okay. Bye. Okay, so I don't know what time it is. What time is it? 11.30, so I was in there for like mm, a little over an hour. I think I did really good. Um, I got everything in that one bag, um, this year giant bag. Um, they even included like one bag or purse. So in the bag sale, they included that gorgeous um, kind of like suitcase purse bag thing. I don't know, but I love it. And I'm like, I could sell that and probably for a lot of money, but I'm really thinking about keeping it maybe for flat lays. I'm not sure because I just love it. And but I wouldn't really use it, use it, but I like just to have it in my house. I think it's so cute. Um, but yeah, I got so much stuff. I got some a bunch of camo stuff for my cousin. So I'm really excited about that. And yeah, I may end up um, sending a box to my mom and dad and then having her just give it to my cousin because I have some clothes for them too that I need to give to them. So yeah, I haven't decided how I'm going to send all that to them. But yep, overall awesome haul. I think I'm going to go over everything here in a little bit. So, yeah. Hey, guys. It's Mara. Um, so, I have this huge haul. Just got home. Um, it all ended up sitting in one very large garbage bag. So, where should I get started? I had to, like, the bag broke on the way in. But, anyway. Um, this is the bag I was talking about. I love it. Love these colors. think it's gorgeous. It's got like buckles and everything. It opens up. If you see that. Like it twists open. I love like the leather detailing on it. The buckles are a little loose on the bottom, but, and this could be re-sewn in here. It's like torn a little bit. But it's made in Hong Kong, and it reminds me of, like, really, like, 80s, 70s. Anyway, I love it. So cute. My lighting is never good, so I kind of have the window. I kind of have yellow, so. Okay, let's move all this over. Also, I don't know if you guys have tried these. It's, like, sugar, coconut water, different drinks. This one is. Blackout berry, and it's really good. 
That was like the pineapple coconut one. Okay, so I got a lot of different stuff, a lot of different types of clothing for different reasons. Um, let's just do one thing at a time. Okay, so first off, like I said earlier, my cousin is having a baby, and I guess uh, the dad really likes uh, camo stuff. So I tried to find some really cute little boy camo stuff. This one has just got like kind of camo print and little stars on it. Thought that was really cute. Um, this one's a, like a blue camo, little onesie deal. That's like six months, so it'll be a while till he wears that, but that's okay. Where else? Oh, I got this one and it says broom and has a little truck and then it's got built in little long sleeve camo stuff. Thought that was really cute. Where's more of it? It kind of got mixed up. That's a shirt for me. That's me. I got a bunch of these cute little camo pants, all different sizes. Um, these are Granimals, 18 months. This one's 18 months. And this one's 12 months. Oh, that one's got a little hole in the pocket. Oh, well. I know boys are harder on clothes, so it feels like it's pretty hard to find boys' clothes. But they actually have quite a bit. Um, they're 12 months. These are little fleece ones. These are cute. These are zero to three months from baby here. Oh, it says three to six in here. Okay, well, they put zero to three on the outside. Can you see that? Like little leggings, pretty much. Hmm. Oh, this one I thought was really cute. It says, Daddy's Hunting Buddy. It's zero to three months. It's got a little duck on there. And this one's 24 months. These are great animals. I wonder if the same person donated all these camo pants. Oh, sorry. If you hear Zelda, that's her. She's over here. Aren't you, Bob? You want to come cuddle? Yeah, you sit. Lay down. Okay. So, Zelda, can you not? Yeah, can you not? Good girl. So, I got these dresses for my niece. This one is missing some of the sequins on here, but it's not, like, it almost looks like spots. Like, well, there was, like, sequins there. Some of the sequins are still on it, but I just thought it was really cute, and her favorite color is purple. So I thought she would like that. So I'll probably send all this stuff to my mom, and she can send it wherever. This one's, um, what is it called? Children's Place. It's a six. She wears like a five or a six now, I think. But she likes pink and purple, and I love this neckline on this one. So really cute. There. Let's see, did I get any more camo boy stuff? I think that's probably it on the kiddo side. So, put that down here. Next thing, um, I got some really cute, like, vintage skirts. This one I loved. It had, like, rodeo cowboys on it, um, and it has this kind of like little tie, fake tie, and it's a wrap skirt, so it opens up, and it's from My Michelle, and it's a nine, but you can tell that's 100% a vintage tag. So there's that. Really love this print. Rodeo cowboy, don't mind that. Don't mind that up there. Next one I got, this one is like linen and Cotton, I think. Oh no, it's rayon and black. I don't really know what that is. Um, but anyway, it's got a zipper side, elastic waist. Hopefully this zipper works. Let's see if it fits this. Is it caught? No, there we go. But I loved all these animals, like these kind of 
um, Egyptian looking style of animals. Love that skirt. I love a kind of out there printed skirt. Um, what else did I get? I got some really cute high waisted shorts. I love these. These are 14, so they'll probably be too big to for me, but I'm not sure. But yeah, they have pockets and everything. Thought these were super cute. Got this pair, which is from Laura Catherine. I don't know who that is. These are 14s too. And these are high waisted, just like a navy blue color. Um, what else? I got these shorts. I I think I'm going to distress these. Um, they're like vintage Calvin Klein. And they're more of like a men's style. They say 32, so I don't know if they're actually men's or not. Um, but they're definitely fit like a relaxed fit. I wonder if it says men on them. Oh, no, they're called Easy Fit Short 9 Inch Double Stone Wash Size 32. So I think these would be super cute distressed and I sold another pair of like vintage Calvin Klein and actually went for really good money. Okay, this top I looked up was actually from like Urban. Uh, this brand is called Project Socialty Los Angeles. I might actually keep this for myself. I, I really love that like little keyhole look and I think it looks good with my um, ostrich neck. But I, uh, I don't have any tops like that. So. Um, next thing I got are these green scrub pants. I usually can wear an extra small in the Grey's Anatomy one. Usually the small ones are too long. I mean, I could wear a small petite or like extra small. It's a little tight in the tummy, but anyway. These are really cute. The, the bottoms are like in perfect condition, so it's not like they're all worn or anything. Um, what else did I get? I got this little like baseball tee. I love baseball tees. I don't have that many. It's a medium. The brand is Cavio women? Never heard of it. Yeah. Super cute. So that's for me. Um, these I love. I love me a vintage Wrangler. Um, and this is in the like sage color. I have another pair of these, I think, but they were in a little bit different color. But I love these. So like I want to keep them as pants. And maybe cut up my other Wrangler ones. Um, I don't know because I just love the color and they're so pretty as pants. But usually the cutoffs sell better. So quite the dilemma. Next pair are these Marseille Fran and Francois Gearbon stone wash. I looked these up and these are vintage and worth actually uh, quite a bit of money. That's what like the front looks like. Sorry, when I zoom in, it makes it cloudy. Yeah. So there's those. Okay, next thing I got, these shorts actually for Marin. Um, they might be a little bit big, but I thought he could wear a belt with them. They're just from Walmart. They're no boundaries, but he wanted darker, uh, kind of like cargo shorts. And these are like a dark blue. can't really tell color-wise, but bye okay this is a really cute nike top now i don't know if it'll go for much since it does look like a older style possibly but yeah where's the swoosh there's what it is anyway so this is pretty cute next probably my favorite find besides my box uh which actually would probably go pretty good with it um, but this is a Lauren Conrad extra small. It was over with like the plus sizes. So I'm like, that's probably why nobody found it yet. That was looking for something like this. Love this style. Love these bell sleeves. Cutest top ever. Seriously. I don't know why would anybody get rid of this, but I love it. I love it so much. And yeah, it definitely looks oversized. If this doesn't fit me, I'm going to cry, but it is an extra small. So I don't know. And these, oh, it's got these, so you, like, tie it around the, the sleeve there. So cute, I love these. 
think it, it definitely doesn't look like an extra small, so fingers crossed. Because I am not an extra small. Um, let's see, next thing I got, I love this top. It's a Rough Rider, which I have some of their jeans that I've tried to sell. Uh, but this is a like, cowgirl kind of skirt. Got the little tassels, and it has a little tassel back there too. And it's a button down. Yeah, when I bring stuff up closer, it makes the lighting weird. Okay, I got, what, three things left. This, I love this vintage, really like hippie 70s dress. I have no idea what the brand is. But it apparently came from two different, it was two. It was a two-piece set, um, but I only have the dress. And it's polyester. Does it say seven piece? I think it's say two. Anyway, it's a 14 petite, but I'll probably just list it as a 14. I mean, these kind of dresses you can wear at whatever length. And I don't even know that that looks like a 14. I feel like not. I feel like maybe a 12. But like I said before, all this vintage stuff sizing is way off compared to now, so it's hard to know. And this looks like the tag is authentically very old. Yeah. So. Anyway, love this dress. I love like the natural pleats and how it's sewn at the waist. I think that is really cute. Um, next thing, this is an Athleta dress. Now it's not like a new one, but I was excited that I actually found Athleta. Um, it's a size large. It's got a built-in bra see that and it's got like this cute crisscross back so it's just an athletic kind of dress and it's like brown and gray and then, yeah like that thought this was really cute so that might be worth some money and then last but not least we have these like stretchy um kind of like yoga pants i guess there's a little bit of a slit at the bottom, and they are by Soft Surroundings. Um, these are a tall long, I think, or a tall large, I mean, tall long, that's the same thing. But yeah, these just have a really like stretchy waist, and I think they'd be really comfortable for those who are looking for it. And the skirt I found the other day was from Soft Surroundings was also a tall medium or tall large no maybe it wasn't anyway tall something so yeah that was my haul i know it was kind of long but i got a ton of stuff and all in one bag which like i said it was busted at the seams and it did break but um yeah that was my haul thank you guys for watching if you have any other ideas for videos i should do um let me know or if you want to know anything more about my hauls um, today I have on my thrifted little Dreamcatcher shirt and these shorts I also got them thrifted and I just wore my Birkenstocks today. Kind of a um, comfy sort of pajama look for this heat. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you later. Bye.